Well, I didn't actually necessarily expect he would say it Tuesday night, but I mean, clear, they've made clear from the beginning, Fisker's made clear, that they need the money in order to, to build out uh, the Delaware plant. Uh, they made clear several months ago that because there was a slowdown uh, in the federal loan, uh, they don't have the money to actually invest in that plant right now, so they're having to uh, look elsewhere. But th they have made it very clear to me that Delaware is their first choice. It's clearly our first choice as well. I think it's been a frustrating experience since the D uh, Department of Energy and Fisker came to an impasse uh, several months ago because the bottom line is they need the money from that federal Department of Energy loan in order to invest in the plant. That money has not been forthcoming, so they're having to do two things simultaneously. One is they're trying to renegotiate with the Department of Energy, and secondly, they're looking for alternative sources of money in case that doesn't work out. We have uh, what we call a clawback provision. If the car does not get built uh, in Delaware, if they build it someplace else, then we would, of course, enforce the clawback provision so that the taxpayers would be repaid. The milestone for them to create the, uh, the number of jobs that have been targeted was 2015. If they decide before then uh, that they're not going to build the car here and build it elsewhere, then we may have to re-enforce that uh, trigger provision on the clawback sooner.